death is supposed to be a boundary, a clear line you cross once and never come back from. But some people have crossed that line while still aware of everything happening around them. Doctors call it cognitive persistence. When a person is clinically dead, no pulse, no breathing, yet their brain continues working. Trapped, silent, listening. There are documented cases where patients later explained, in chilling detail, the conversations that happened around their lifeless bodies. They heard surgeons declaring their time of death. They heard family members crying. They heard the room moving on, as if they were already gone, but they couldn't move, couldn't open their eyes, couldn't scream for help. Their consciousness was floating inside a body that the world had already given up on. Here's the paradox. If you're clinically dead, but you remain aware, are you truly dead? Or are you a living mind trapped in a dead machine? Some researchers believe the brain may fight for seconds, even minutes, trying to hold on. Others say awareness might linger even longer, in a state we don't yet understand. Which means the most unsettling question is this. How many people have died, fully aware of the moment they crossed over?